Yeah, because I, I figured this would be a good opportunity to uh, discuss how we feel about where we are so far. We're this game is so spots. fucking cool. It's so fucking good, man. Oh, it's so fucking good. Oh, except when the best character died. That that. The Chad, by the way, we're getting into spoilers. If you care, um, if you're not at least forty percent in, tune off. The dog becomes the next icon. He is every icon. Yeah, Torgal is um, Alexander's dominant. Yes, yes, exactly. But, <sighs> yeah, no, the, the game is. Want to scoot in a bit more? Pretty. So, uh, I can yeah. see for this. Switch to this one. But yeah, that shit. It's bust. Game is bust. Sorry, I was no, moving, moving PlayStation. You weren't ready there. to stream, bro? No, because I, I literally and told you I didn't feel like streaming, and then I was like, no, I can't get enough of this. Yeah, <laughs> I, I've had a hard time just putting this game down. I've literally been just playing it all day. Ugh. Okay, so you said you were just barely ahead of me, because I, yes. I stopped right after um, they were killing the bears in the church in Rosaria. Uh, wait, that's when you stopped? I thought you uh, around went to. The time I, stopped. I thought you went to. Uh, what's it called? Like you, you went to the new hideaway. You saw yes. the hunting board. Yes. And then uh, I saw you like. I think you were like hunting like one of the. Bad I people. tried to find them, but I was like so yeah, tired and I, I couldn't find I one. I saw the definition was like super vague, and I was like, ah, I'll, I'll run into it eventually. But uh, I, I just went through with the story a little bit more. I did some side missions, but I'm like. Maybe 20 minutes ahead. Like not, not very far at all. Fair enough. Okay, so we need to talk about Sid. Bro, which one? Yeah, which, <laughs> which one? Oh, but that was dude, that was pretty fucking cool, though. Yeah, no, that that was fucking awesome. Dude, that whole, like, that lasted so much longer than I thought it was. I mean, guaranteed, you know, it said pivotal moment in the story. But, like, you go in there, like, you sneak in, You there's an aether flood kill all the people just to get to the fucking thing and then you fight a giant ass dragon then you go up there you open you blow up the fucking crystal with ramu and then the fucking black hole opens and the fucking <laughs> thing just starts crawling out and then it sucks you in into the time sphere and you <laughs> fight them once and then you fight six of them at once and then you turn into and the then they, and then they combine together yeah, and then he grows multiple saying. limbs <laughs> and he didn't even grow back i think it was schizo who said wait this motherfucker grew more arms and didn't grow legs <laughs> <laughs> well, none of them had legs. <laughs> no, all just horses. No, because he said something like, oh, all of you combined to get more limbs, but you didn't make more legs? What I didn't understand is there was like eight of them, and he only got two more arms. I was, <laughs> I was expecting him to have like hella arms. Oh my god, I was... Because I didn't know how far you were, I was about to say, did you do the fucking Typhon fight yet? Yeah, that shit was lit. And the music was like super funky. And I, I was like, ooh, <laughs> this shit's mad busting right now. But, uh... Yeah, and then... Then fucking Sid does. That was brutal. And then they confirmed that it was Joshua. I think we both know as soon as he took the hood off. But fucking Joshua was back. And then they're like five years later. I'm like, what the fuck? I was what, like, what, what happened, happened to Joshua? <laughs> I was like, what happened to Joshua? Yeah, and then there's like that fucking mysterious being character. Uh, what's it? Ultima. Ultima, who is a... Um, Ultima was like a summon. He's a summon himself from like the old Oh, games. really? Okay, okay. So we so don't know my boy Joshua has two uh, summons in him? We don't know what that exactly means yet. That yeah. can mean anything. Yeah, he just like ate him and then... Yeah, he kind of ate him and then just went, goodbye, world. Yeah, yeah, here's a, here's a feather I'm out. But, uh... Yeah, no, the gameplay is so lit. You know, you have, now you have Ramu, you got the fucking, the sharpshooter aim and like, can electrocute all those people. I love that Ramu's circle is just Artemis from Devil May Cry, just locking on the multiple enemies at <laughs> once. I'm such a fan of that. <laughs> and, and, um, did you notice, and I got, I didn't notice it till chat pointed it out to me because I was so into the fight when the mm. time skip started, when his life bar changed to Sid the Outlaw. I did not know. You didn't that. see, yeah. I didn't see that either because it didn't say climb. It said Sid the Outlaw. That's sick. That's sick. But yeah, that 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 was a hard punch to the gut. But I mean, I saw it coming as soon as like uh, they were in the brothel, like talking, and he was like, "Ah, oh, yes, like as long as my name is fermented in legacy, like that's all I care about." And I was like, "Oh no." I think me, me and Chat were constantly talking about it as soon as he died and, you know, he gave his powers to Clive. What's gonna happen to Jill? Yeah. 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 I want those ice powers though, baby. Fuck Jill. I want those. I want Shiva in my body. I need that. I need that ice powers. He's my wife, though. I don't but... know if you will, though, because I'm surprised that we got Ramu, because, like, 
I knew you were gonna get more summons, but uh, we know fucking you're gonna get the Titan, the Titan power eventually. But the only ones that are left are Odin, Bahamut, Titan, Titan and Shiva. Shiva yeah. Those are the only and ones left. Ultima, Tech. Who knows? Who knows? Dude, you know what hit me hard? A death that uh, I, I watched your clip of it is when Lady Hannah died. And I was like, bro, what? <laughs> like, no. <laughs> They did such a good job of making you, like, go through, like, you know, you did that one bit where, you know, you realized that Clive was just suppressing his, the truth within himself, that he was the one who killed Joshua. Yeah, that and shit he was, was like, why? And then he went, you know what? I accept these terms. And then yeah, he and fights just... him. And I was like, okay, yeah. And then you get Ifrit, like, okay, yeah. And then you go to Rosario, like, oh, no. Yeah, yeah, you're like, <laughs> oh, man. But no, that fight, that fight was... Honestly, probably my favorite part of the game so far is like you fight yourself like one on one, and then he gets devil trigger, and you guys fight, and then you get devil trigger, and then you guys fight, and then you fight his Efree, and then you get E. Dude, that part where you get Efree, and it's like the heartbeat. He's like, I will, uh, I will. No like, matter take what, it. no matter what truth that awaits yeah, me, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then on. it says, press L three R three to accept the, the truth. truth, and it's like <laughs> boom, boom, <laughs> boom, boom, boom. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. <laughs> Like, this game is so fucking cool. Uh, I, this is like, I was saying to Chad, this is like, this is like the, the first Final Fantasy in such a long time since like 12 that has felt like an actual like big game. Yeah. Because it's, I think this point when Clive is the adult, like in his adult years now, mm. I, was like, I think this is where the game actually starts. Yeah, yeah, that was just all like prelude. I'm surprised they didn't just go Final Fantasy 16 after Sid died. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, thank you. You know, it would have been a baller move to just pull up the title card again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but goddamn, I haven't watched uh, too much of your stream. I've just like seen clips, like I've just seen like hype moments. I'm like, I wonder what Sam said when this happened, Lady Hannah and all that shit. But uh, I see you've been working in the labs. I yes, in the... I did. I I have been posting on my Snapchats. Yeah, yeah. So I've seen. So I've seen. Yeah, I um. Where the hell did I put my work? Uh, oh. over there. Hey. Oh fuck. Uh, schizo. Your dog, your dog can transform into a human. I knew it. Uh, it just caught up. I didn't say the legs. Okay, but some somebody did, and that was the funny part, because that's what I remember. Somebody said that, and I was laughing. <laughs> all the all that power, and you don't grow back legs. Oh, that that fight, but the Typhon fight was just was so FF14 ex inspired with the um, you know, the tells of the thing showing up on the ground. You're like. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then like when you're fighting him as Efree and he's like launching the walls at you and you have to like go like left to right to left to right. That yeah, that's so that's all sick. that's all F that's what FF14 raids are like. That's yeah. what bosses do is that the tails will show up on the floor and you're like, "Oh, I got to go." Oh, speaking of which, since you got me the game inside of there was a free month subscription for FF14. Uh, Maybe we'll have to do a little less, Yeah, a it's little, little, uh, live stream. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That is what that is, right? I could have sworn that. Oh, did you go into? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's on the other side, but yeah, that one. It's fine. In the FF14 team landing shots, because they made this game too. They're mm -hmm. la landing shots. Honestly, best. Mm, I, game of the year already. Game of the year already. It's yeah. definitely my like favorite game in a long time. I don't know uh, if it'll hold up once Spider Man 2 comes out, but this game is definitely going to give it some hard, hard competition, gameplay wise. And they just played me in chess. All right, I gotta go. Yeah, <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> yeah I think I think the only thing I can uh, talk about is um, like I haven't had any like hard complaints at all. Like, mm -hmm. there's, been, there's been nothing so far that has made me like upset or just like, oh man, I wish this was a thing. Because you know, at first when we played the demo, I was like, oh, L one's lock on. That's a little bit. It's like a toggle yeah, lock on. Yeah, R one's a bit too weird, evade, but it. But you get used to, you now. get used to that so it feels quickly. So good. And yeah, I and really figure and now I have like a basic bread and butter. I you know, I'm now I have three summons. I'm pretty much doing the devil may cry thing where I'm just double tapping L2 to like to mm -hmm, switch yeah. to my things quicker and it's just like I I have the rhythm now. I I think I know how the game works. Yeah, I've been very much enjoying the gameplay. I don't have like crazy combos like you, but I'm, I'm pretty pretty efficient in killing things. Uh, it's pretty fun. <laughs> yeah. There's there's two ways of playing action games, chat. Being the combo lab, pressing buttons and killing stuff. Yeah, killing Wait. things as fast and as efficient as possible. 
You should see me go against one of those, like, uh, those two, or, like, full stagger bars, like, when you, like, uh, get them halfway and then you, like, use Garuda to pull them down. Bro. I got it. I got it. <laughs> I I'm got it. That shit just... <laughs> oh, man. Especially the first thing I bought, because I wasn't a huge fan of, uh, Ramu's, uh, like, icon powers, like the R2 square and R2 triangle. Like, they're not bad, but... They're mainly uh, combo enders more than anything, yeah, literally. they're so strong. So I just immediately bought, like, the... The like level three one where you just like uh, do massive amounts of damage to one enemy, and so like I just use that on like those stagger enemies, like those higher tier bigger guys. So so good though. Oh yeah, I've been so good. It's so fucking good. It's so fucking good. I can't I can't recommend it more. Like Nick is sleeping on this game, and like every time he pops in, he's like, Yeah, I was gonna ask, has he been like going like, so how's it? How's it going? So like he pops in, and he's just like makes some joke, like he he doesn't like it, and then I talk I talk to him about it like when we're outside, like in the living room, and then he's like, Damn, that game does sound pretty cool. I should play it. And I'm like, I don't know how many times I can tell you, bro. Just just go play it or don't. Like. What's funny is we should like <laughs> do in like an intervention stream where we mm -hmm. we set up a stream. He doesn't know he's about to play it, and then and then we'll just be like, Sit down. Now <laughs> we'll, do another, we'll do another like Monster Hunter play, where it was a uh, Monster Hunter, but it was actually Little Big Planet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> or was but, yeah. it Little Big Planet? I can't remember. What yeah, it was. yeah, it was the Spooks episode yeah, yeah, yeah. where I baited everyone to think it was a Monster Hunter video. But yeah, Golden. <laughs> they await you in Ordil, Guardians of the Flame. <laughs> Yeah, that's a great death noise. Those are Old Hills Gates. I'm sorry, the way he, the way he went, they wait for you in the Guardian of Flames. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even replicate it. Yeah. <laughs> I just tried to. He's like, <laughs> he goes like really high pitch with yeah, it. He's yeah. like, <laughs> and it, even, it's hurting my throat trying to do that. <laughs> Damn you! <laughs> you know what? That's for making. This is where I'm making my throat hurt. 